Hi, welcome to Project Geospatial. I'm Adam Simmons here at the G1 2024 Symposium here in Orlando, Florida. Well, in this segment, I have the pleasure of talking with uh, Vic from Equinex. Yep. Awesome. Uh, can you tell us a little bit about yourself first? Before we dive into the company, I just want to learn a little bit more about sure. your background, um, how you started in the industry, uh, you know, just, just from a career aspect, so we can uh, talk with uh, young professionals at some point about uh, potential careers. So. For me, I've always liked to learn, right? And okay. technology has been one of the areas where I grew up with the whole technology curve. And I started out my career at IBM, uh, PwC Consulting, which was then bought by IBM, which then I joined the enterprise engineering contract at NGA back in 2005. And that's where I started my geospatial NGA career. Um, worked there for about seven years, um, then continued to support DIA um, in the intelligence community, as well as some federal civilian organizations. And through the process, I learned about cloud computing. I learned about technologies uh, from the top stack software as a service to all the way down to now network as a service. And at Equinix, um, I'm here at Equinix working to, you know, it rounds out my career um, to now talk for, from the whole stack perspective, the full solution for the customer. And one more on that. Where did you start off? What was your, uh, what was your profession or starting your, your, your major? What was your uh, skill set? Uh, before Absolutely. you get in all this. So um, undergrad at Commerce and Engineering Sciences at Drexel University, and I got an MBA um, at Boston University. So after that, so I have a combination of business and engineering technology science skills. So I kind of combined that and um, learned about the technology suite. And I could talk to both sides, if you will. No, no worries. And I appreciate the insight. Uh, right. See, so you, you can do quite a bit with uh, not knowing what you can do with your uh, degree, 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 pro yeah, degree programs. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, amazing to know where you are now, too. Yeah, so today I'm at Equinix. Um, I'm an account executive here supporting NGA. And, um, you know, we're looking to help them modernize their network. Um, they have a lot of data coming from all around the world. And at Equinix, we have a, a, an ecosystem of interconnected global data centers, about 260 around the world, um, where we've developed an ecosystem of partners. All these companies probably are on our... Well, you data just centers. you just hinted at it. You have a lot of data centers. Mm -hmm. Is that what Equinix is? Is that a data center uh, company, at or a is core, it, or much much broader? What what is it at a bigger level? So we're we're at a core we're our data centers, right? Okay. That's our core. Um, we have two hundred sixty worldwide. However, we deliver infrastructure services. We deliver network services. Um, we provide bare metal services, um, platform as a service, infrastructure as a service. Companies can build their on-prem um, capabilities in our facilities. Okay, and uh, in, in terms of how that works behind the scenes, in because I, I I think I've heard of your company interacting with uh, with with bigger companies like Google and Amazon. Mm -hmm. What does that mean compared to what they have and what you what services Absolutely. you provide? So um, we one of the big key things are interconnected interconnection services, right? Um, we have data centers around the world that are all connected through a fabric, and. We have the largest cloud service provider ecosystem in our uh, platform. Um, so there, it's easy for companies and organizations to connect to these clouds. And for NGA, we can also have them do, initiate their multi-cloud strategies as well. So, Okay, well, that's amazing. So tell us a little bit more about uh, what you'd like our audience to know about Equinix and the direction that your company is going uh, moving forward. Good question. Um, Equinix, we're, we're here to help provide the network foundation, right? And provide the interconnections with all the cloud service providers, all of the vendors here um, in a simple manner. We're working with NGA to relieve their RAN, uh, RAN congestion, increase their latency, reduce their network costs. Um, and we believe that we could provide that um, as a foundation within our uh, digital platform. So it sounds like on some, do, on some level, you can interconnect and uh, be all of these vendors and services Absolutely. that are present at this conference right here. Absolutely, and especially on the unclassified side right now. Um, let's just say Maxer. I don't know if they're on our network yet, but if they were, they could. If they're in remote locations all around the world, they have ground stations. We can get connected to them, put it on our backbone, and then send the data all around the world if we have to through our ecosystem. And it doesn't matter what kind of data it is. It doesn't matter what kind of data it is. We're here to move the bits and bytes, right? We could do it at a layer two or a layer three. You tell us. Can you touch a little bit on the, the security of, uh, of that uh, type of operation? Absolutely. So by being on our 
uh, fabric in our, in our ecosystem, um, you're bypassing the, the dirty internet, if you will, the open internet. You're really in our in our network foundation and infrastructure where it's secure. You know, you come in, we have security uh, measures throughout our network. So it's a massive intranet per se. Uh, something like that, yeah. yeah. Okay. I'm not as technical, but yeah, you could call it that. <laughs> oh, all good. My all solution good. architect would differ in that nomenclature. I'm oversimplifying yeah, it. I but understand. Absolutely. But yeah. So it's a private network, basically, that we allow our customers to connect into the other customers without any um, intrusions, right? Once you come into our data centers, consider us you know, providing a lot of the security and stuff. Okay, great. Well, as we wrap up, one last question for you. Uh, you know, the, the so symposium is pretty vast, mm -hmm. a lot of interesting stuff going on. What's been the uh, biggest surprise technology that you've seen uh, walking through the floor? So I see a lot of this uh, software companies here that have uh, AI incorporated, you know, uh, recognizing an image and what's, what's in the cat, you know, what's in the whatever image. Is it a plane ship? What kind of ship? That's amazing. Yeah. You know, um, and then, you know, it, the NVIDIA uh, demonstration yesterday was, was pretty enlightening and how they're using that to further uh, do quick analysis of uh, the images. Okay, great. Yeah. Well, thank you, sir. And uh, once again, how, how can people find more about your company if they want to reach out? Uh, Equinex.com. Sweet. <laughs> Short and simple. Thank you. Awesome. Well, I'm Adam Simmons of Project Geospatial. We will talk to everybody next time.